welcome to another video a walk on the wild side and i am here in blackpool i am in the town center here st john square just across from the winter gardens here behind me check out the tower there blackpool tower and it's a saturday and it's the third day of the rebellion festival which i was sort of planning to film earlier on today until we had these uh, protests which kind of got in the way a little bit so what I thought I'd do in this video is, it's, um, what time is it? It's about quarter to ten at night. And I think, I think they're all kicking out of the Winter Gardens, the Rebellion Festival. So we'll go and have a look around, shall we? Check out that sky there. About half an hour after sunset, the sky's still got a nice bit of twilight in it. Here's the view of the tower. So... As you can see here, we've got a load of punks here. We all collect here outside St. John's Square, outside the Winter Gardens. Just here we've got a bit of a fountain, but it doesn't, they don't run it that often. Might still be going on, I don't know. It might still be, be going on yet. Still fairly early. There's a lot of taxis pulling up here, picking people up. And, whatever so what i thought i'd do is we'd take a look around oh hello got a riot van here they were pretty busy earlier on well hopefully all of that all the shenanigans from earlier they're all over but this is the main entrance to the winter gardens that's where the festival yo hiya some fans of the channel there yeah so the festival is taking place right here at the famous Blackpool Winter Gardens and it's always a massive event every year Rebellion, I'll tell you what we'll do, let's go this way shall we because uh, people all over the place it's a really good atmosphere spoiled a little bit today by the the protests that we had but at least it uh, at least it didn't kick off, this is a West Coast Rock Cafe a very popular venue that. The only thing is I went in there once and it was so noisy. You couldn't hear yourself. You couldn't you couldn't speak to to each other. It was that noisy. Wasn't really all that impressed. But just down here we've got the Scream and Shake Horror Cafe. It's rocking in here, look at this. And we've got a place next door called the tavern, Shicker's Tavern. Look at that there. It's banging here. Check it out. This is Burley Street. Burley Street, where we've got this big, massive, um, big uh, multi million pound Las Vegas style um, light show and music not working at the moment but I'm going to head down here towards the Rosencraft the pub the Rosencraft there should be loads of them outside there let's go and check it out I quite like this let me know what you think Brilliance it's called so it's called Brilliance obviously got music lights and projections and all that sort of thing and it was put here, oh god, how long ago now? Ages ago, more than a decade ago. And they wanted to create like a cafe culture down here, so we've got cafes. Cafes. Didn't quite work out, really. So this is the Rosen Crown pub, and these are the hosts of Rebellion. For this, what an atmosphere. Check it out, there you go. It's always a good atmosphere when Rebellion comes to town in Blackpool every year, every August. Oh, check out that view of the tower there, look. Wow. So there's a really good atmosphere here at the Rosen Crown. We've got a live band on there by this sound of it uh, 
I'm just going to head down this way. We'll have a little look at the usual, the usual huts down here. Down here we've got Brannigans straight ahead. Banging in Brannigans over there. We've got the Weatherspoons. A bit further down there we've got uh, Yates's. We've also got Hush on the Hush as well. Hush Blackpool's iconic R&B venue. Bit of a different vibe down here. Just there, we've got Revolution. That's closing any time. It could be closing within the next week. Yeah, so let's have a look at this view of the tower there. There you go, look at that. Check it out. Plenty of colour around. Oh, nearly got run over by a bus there. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. Oh, that's where I'm walking. I'm going to take a left up here and we'll head, head up Church Street. So I'm just heading up Church Street. That's the Grand Theatre there, all lit up in purple. It's looking rather grand. They've got scaffolding on it at the moment. They're doing a bit of work to it. I'll just quickly show you the other way. We're looking back the other way now. Scruffy Murphy's is pretty busy. head up here now and we'll walk past the other entrance to the winter gardens and we'll see what it's like over there shall we yeah so with all the shenanigans going on before I kind of missed the uh, uh, the punk so what I thought I'd do is I'd come out tonight and uh, we'll have a look around at night it's always a bit more atmospheric at night as well isn't it so let's carry on shall we Looks like someone's uh, probably had a bit too much there. I'll head down this way now. This is Coronation Street. Let's head down here, shall we? So just down here is the other entrance to the Winter Gardens, and this is the one with the big. You see that there? The big arch sort of end that's the spanish hall if you ever go in the winter gardens i'll check it out the spanish hall it's just up there it's amazing it's actually looking pretty quiet around here there's loads and loads of them out, out here the other week or should i say the other day it's only been going on since thursday so this is the third day saturday so it's the last day tomorrow of rebellion So there's still loads of people in there. I don't think it's kicking out time just yet. Absolutely huge event. Yeah, anyway, let's have a look at the tower here. Look at this now. Black, black with illuminations down here. Look at this. The Batlot Cinema. Yeah, this is Blackpool's newest cinema. Check it out. Look at that view of the tower there. Doesn't it look awesome? I can hear a load of music coming from here. This is Olympia. All this here is Olympia. And obviously, it sounds like they're, they're playing in there at the moment. It's banging in there. Listen to that. Wow. That is banging. Can we see through the gap in the door? Oh, look at this. See that? See for a gap in the door there. Just over there we've got the Batlock Diner. I did a video on that. I did a video on that and the, uh, the cinema if you want to check them out when it opened. So, and IMAX of course. So this is all the House Hill Centre. That used to be Debenhams over there. All that building there was Debenhams. Originally, not anymore. So let's have a look around, shall we? This road here is called Adelaide Street, and that goes right up the side of the Winter Gardens. 
So that's Olympia there. That's one of the old entrances there, that there. In fact, this was where the giant wheel of Blackpool used to be, which was demolished in 1929. It was situated right here, as we have another right van come down. Here we go. Hello. They'll be uh, patrolling around, making sure everything's all right after the protests that we had earlier. I'll just take a walk up here. We've got a few hotels up here. We've got some nice hotels actually up here. Check it out. Garden Suites. This one here is called the Adelaide Adelaide House. I like the lions. Look at that there. A lot of people sat outside. It's a nice evening tonight. A little bit breezy, but it's been it's a bit dry today. <coughs> Sorry, I've still got a bit of a cough. <clears throat> yeah, there's some nice hotels up here. <clears throat> this one's called the New Australia. I can still hear that banging music. It's absolutely... I think I'd have to wait. Headphones. Now, it was only the other week, you know, that I was round here and they were doing the PDC darts, a massive darts tournament right here they had tv vans all the way along here and now it's a completely different story they've got a concert going on a massive festival the rebellion festival yeah you couldn't move around here for all the all the uh, the tv vans all the way up this road and right up here yeah Check out that view of the tower, isn't it? Absolutely awesome, looking down Adelaide Street here. In the olden days, we would have run straight to the promenade, but uh, obviously since we've got the Hounds Hill Centre down there now, it's all pedestrianised, so it comes to an end just down there. I can still hear that music, by the way. I'm miles away now, but I can still hear it. It's absolutely banging in there. So I'm now just at the top corner now with the Winter Gardens, and this is the entrance to the Empress Ballroom, a very, very popular venue for concerts. So it's another venue within the Winter Gardens. Now they might have a band playing on in there as well at the same time as the other one, playing at the Olympia. So, yeah, I mean the Winter Gardens is massive and we're so looking to have it in Blackpool. And just up here, is the old new conference center section as you can see this was completed when was it completed uh, 18 months ago or so i can't quite remember massive security on here as well but this venue this uh, festival this huge festival there have been so many people into blackpool and it's always a good good atmosphere good natured and there's never ever any trouble at Rebellion. I'll tell you what, those seagulls like to make a noise as well, don't they? I'm just making my way around now. I'm coming back into St John's Square again. Got a restaurant on the corner there called Amaro. What's that? Swanky, look at that. Has anyone been in there? Let me know. Amaro. So they're certainly spending the money in Blackpool. Yeah, it's a good event for Blackpool. We've got the air show coming next. Yeah, we've got the air show, yeah. So I'll be watching the air show. Getting a wave off the taxi driver here. How are you doing? Okay. So there you go. That was a little look around Blackpool. Um, just covering the, uh, the, the rebellion. Festival. Uh, hello, it's Jamie's Rock and Soul. Check him out. Jamie's Rock and Soul on YouTube. Hello, hello. how are you? Isn't it wonderful? His... Aren't the people lovely? It's really, really good, yeah. I mean, I've just walked around the whole of the Winter Gardens and I was just saying that there's never any trouble at the Rebellion, is there? It's all cracking atmosphere. Everyone's having a good time. Everyone's sat outside here, you know. We... I've just been past the concert as well. Absolutely banging. Honestly, you know, you I know would what's go great get... as well. 
They're yeah. so happy to talk to you, aren't they? Yeah, well, I don't actually talk to people. <laughs> I, 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 I've spoken to, I've spoken to loads of fans. I've, I've spoken to loads of fans. I'm always getting people coming up to me and saying, see, we love your channel. I've had loads of people tonight. I had loads of people earlier on. I've been doing some videos earlier on. And uh, it's all good. So there you go. Yeah. Well, I'm trying yeah. to get an exclusive. Well, Apparently, Johnny Rotten is in the Winter Gardens. Johnny and he Rotten. smokes a lot of fags. So Johnny. maybe he might be at that posh entrance well, having a fag or something. We might have to look for Johnny Rotten. And don't forget to follow Jamie's Rock and Soul on YouTube. Love yous. Nice to meet you, bro. Cheers. Have fun. So there you go, that's it for this video. A bit of a walk around uh, Blackfield just to make up for the... Um, I was supposed to do it earlier and uh, you know what got in the way, don't you? But anyway, that's it for this video. I hope you like it. If you do, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos and I'll see you again on the next one.